Hello, everyone. First of all, let's check the inspirational picture from Pinterest. Look at this backdrop. Today, I'm going to make the backdrop like this with the material I have. Okay, now let's go. Okay, first of all, let's make the backdrop, starting with these two colors of fabric. Okay, complete it with the tube pocket making. Look, I fast forward the procedure because I already took a step-by-step -step tutorial to show you how to make the pocket for the uh, tube of the stand. If you are interested, you can click here. I don't repeat the procedure here. Okay, now let's put it on the stand. Okay, look, I put the fabric on the stand as the first layer of the backdrop. For the second layer of backdrop, we will use the other color of fabric. And I lower the stand because it will be much more convenient for me to hang up the fabric. And for the two layer of, of the backdrop setting, normally we need to use the stand with durable tube. But since I only have the stand with one tube, so I will tie another tube on the stand. Okay, look, I hand up the second layer of the fabric on the better stand and raise up the stand. Look, adding the other two, the second two on the backdrop, just use some firm legs two and tie with the string on the stand will be okay. Uh, if your stand just only have one two, you can adding the second two by this method. Okay. And about the sec this color of fabric, I use six panel. Look, let's separate the fabric. Okay, look, after we separate the fabric, we got six panel. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then we will tie the fabric to make the decoration like this. First of all, we will tie the first fabric and the fourth fabric together. Like this. The first fabric and the fourth fabric. I will tie them together. I will show you the effect. Okay, look. This is the effect after I tie these two fabric together. And then the following, I will tie the second fabric from the back side of these two fabric. I will tie the second fabric onto the stand. And I will show you the effect. Okay, look, this is the effect after I tie the second fabric to the this side of the stand. And then I will tie the first fabric together with the four, five, six, the sixth panel of fabric together. 
the the number third and number six fabric. I will show you the effect. Okay, look, this is the effect after I tie the number three and number six fabric together. And then the last the fabric, number five fabric, I will tie it to this side of the stand. I will show you the effect. Okay, look, this is the effect after I tie the number five fabric to the stand. Okay, the following, we need to adjust the sweat and adjust the height of each tight fabric. And also, look, this is the pole, this is the tube of the stand. If you want to cover it, you can use an other fabric and tie it around the stand. Tie it on the stand to cover the tube will be okay. But since I don't have enough stand, I will wrap the this fabric on the stand to cover the tube. I will show you the effect later. And also, look, look at this rest out from the fabric. This is not the quality problem. All the fabric from the factory, the edge of the fabric will be look like this. If you don't like it, you can cut it off. And also, you can hide it by adjust the fabric. Okay then, I will adjust everything and show you the effect. Uh, one thing I forgot. Uh, if you since we need to adjust the white of the fabric to cover the pole, the tube of the stand, and if you want to make the ruffle string, uh, the sweat string of the fabric, you can draw, jet the fabric from the tight to adjust it to release release this end of fabric. To make it to cover the stand, I will show you the effect. Okay, look, complete with the adjusting. I wrap the fabric around the pole so the tube so it will cover the tube and adjust the width of the uh, fabric. Also, hide the thread. Actually, if you have some print, actually direct cut it off will be okay. If you don't cut it off, just use some print, pink on it will be okay. And adjust the width of the fabric to cover the pole by jacking and adjust the fabric. The length of fabric you want will be okay. Okay, then the following. We will make the flower arrangement and tie it on the tie. Okay, look, I make four flower ball. The following, uh, very simple, just use some hot group and stick a ribbon on the slide and tie it on the fabric will be okay. I will show you the effect. Okay, completed. Let's check the effect. Look, this is the whole effect. Look, what do you think? Do you like it? Actually, it's really, really simple to make the backdrop like this and to come out really pretty. I think I need to use some deeper color of flower to make the flower ball. The come out will be much more pop. But anyway, I'm not good at color matching. Maybe you can do it much more better than what I made. Okay. 
And for your information, we surprise almost all the material used on our tutorial. Soon in to check the data. Look, our flowers. If you are interested to buy, you can inbox me via Facebook page. For the quotation, look, our flowers, different type of flower. You can find the link to my Facebook page and the blog for the product link from the information field below this video. Okay, and if you don't want to waste time to make the pocket for the pole of the the tube of the stand, you can ask me to make for you. I will help someone much more professional to make it. Of course, you need to pay some extra fee will be okay, not expensive. And also, please do me a favor, but do not skip the advertisement. Because I want the revenue from YouTube and buy more material and take more video. Okay, if the backdrop wider, the come out will be much more pretty. Since I just show you the sample. Okay, this is today's tutorial. Thank you for your watching. Bye bye.